Hi Scorpio, welcome to your reading. If you are new here and don't want to miss the daily tarot readings, you can subscribe now by clicking the red button below this video. This is a general love reading, so it may or may not resonate with all of you. At the end of this video, if you are interested, I will also record an extended to know more specific details on their feelings and intentions for you at this moment. Now let's start with your reading. I will start with what happened in the past and why it all happened. Then at the end of uh, this reading, I will see their possible actions towards you, if any, for the time frame of this reading. So let's first shuffle four times. So let's see, this is the overall energy, but we will start with what happened in the past and why it all happened, so you better will know if this reading resonates with you. Someone decided to give up on that connection because it's it seemed like a big bird. It couldn't move forward anymore despite the effort, despite the in good intention to see progress there. So it felt like a big burden. I don't know who gave up first, but someone or the person that gave up first f felt like the connection was too much to carry forward. Uh, there was intention, a good intention there to see progress, to see movement forward, despite the differences that you had about uh, the vision for the future together. Now let's see about the current energies. I think that uh, you, are, you are hurt. Uh, from what happened, but you are still resisting giving up. You're still waiting for a positive change to happen and um, Regarding progress and stability. I don't think you'd uh, jump immediately into a committed Relationship with them, but you take it one step at a time. This is the energy that you have at this moment now let's see what is affecting you in your subconscious that you may not be aware of is the fact that Maybe you have tried to give up uh, or you are trying to give up from a situation that seemed that it was not working and you don't like that because you have the nine of wands. Now you are resisting there, you are still holding tightly to it, but deep inside it seems like uh, they didn't let you any other choice but to give up. How you view the situation? Now in fact you expect communication. Your intuition is telling you that there may be some communication happening. For some, it may be a long distance between both of you. You expect them to to reach out to you despite the long uh, physical distance. So they may travel and meet you. That's what you may be uh, thinking or feeling, your intuition. Uh, and let's see what is the overall energy. It is the four of wands. You want commitment with this person. You want stability. I think you want to marry them or you want to move that connection to the next important step. But if we watch the current energies, uh, you want that stability with this person, you want to celebrate the love with them, but at the same time you don't want to rush it. Because of what happened in the past, you want, you want to be ultra uh, secure about uh, the fact that uh, has this person changed or will this person provide me the... Uh, stability that uh, you want. Now let's see more details. What you want to avoid and what you fear. I see you being sad for quite some time, disappointed by what happened. You didn't expect it to happen like that and you don't want to be in that energy anymore. So that's why I think you are trying to give up uh, from that connection because maybe you are thinking that now I better search for a new partner, a new better partner than be in this position of uh, just uh, sadness and disappointment. And what you want to avoid is being in a connection with someone that plays mind games, that is not honest, and where the connection is with lots of conflicts and arguments and where you both don't find the common language. Now let's see about this person, what is their energy at this moment? Ace of Pentacles, they want to message, in fact. They want to message you. I don't know if they will, but 
Uh, let's see, why the Ace of Pentacles? They miss you as a friend, they have feelings for you, King of Cups, they want to be happy with you, the Sun, Six of Wands, they want to celebrate the love with you. Let's see at the bottom of the deck, Eight of Cups. Okay, I think you are mirroring each other here, because this person has tried quite some time to move away. Maybe they are still moving away from you. They decided to give up uh, a long time ago. Uh, earlier than you. But I think that now they are finding it very difficult to move away from you because they want to message you. They see that they have feelings and they haven't been happy since uh, they broke up with you. So there's a, there's lots of internal conflict uh, from this person here. That's why they want to message you, they want to hear from you. Let's see, will they take any actions uh, for the time frame of this reading? Queen of Cups in the reverse. Uh, so their intention is to message you, but I don't see them communicating any feelings or expressing anything there. Let's uh, let's clarify why the Queen of Cups in the reverse. So this is just for the time frame of this reading. Yes, they want to. They th they uh, think the connection is was a bit toxic. They still are obsessed with you, but there's lots of pain and hurt. Uh, I don't think they have healed totally from what ha from what happened, or they may think that you haven't healed. Completely, completely from what happened. Uh, there may have been a third party situation as well, so take what resonates. There's uh, this pain, this hurt that is still present in this uh, memory of the connection. That's why they are not reaching out. Uh, that's why they are being hesitant. That's why they don't have that self-confidence to pick up the phone and call you or send a message or travel and meet you. So they want to, they have feelings, they want to be with you, they want to see success there. But unfortunately, this person, at least for the time frame of this reading, is not going to express any feelings, even though they want to, at this moment. Uh, maybe later they will have the courage, I don't know. But let's see in the extended, let's see more details there about... Uh, about their feelings at this moment, how do they view you, what are their intentions, uh, the mutual energy and the energies around each one of you at this moment. If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below. See you the next reading and bye for now.